we are in a great time of exposure. Let, let me just assure all of you people that have absolutely no clue of what is going on. Let me assure you that God is tearing down Satan's system and he is using specific Christians to do so. You think you understand because you believe in Jesus Christ that you know the world that you live in and you couldn't be any further from the truth than an atheist. You couldn't be any further from the truth than a reprobate when it comes to knowing what is going on in this world. We are in a time of abundant knowledge and God said that his people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Do you understand that we are in a time of exposure and Satan's kingdom is being dismantled? I have had it to the nth degree with people that refuse to accept what is happening in this world. Everything is being exposed. All of the deceptions, all of the lies are starting to be exposed. And now I'm going to get on you, especially you Christians that seem to think you have the truth and that seem to think that you have the knowledge. And what I'm going to tell you is you are dead asleep to what is happening here in this world if you do not know that this world is not a spinning wet ball and that water does not curve and there is no curve we're not spinning we're not spinning at 70,000 miles an hour it's not happening more importantly we are not hurtling through outer space at over a million miles an hour get real you call yourselves Christians, but you don't believe your own scripture. Paul said that Satan is the god of this world. Scripture says that Satan is the great deceiver. Scripture tells us that Satan has deceived the entire world. The world is not a ball. It's time to wake up. We are in a time of great exposure. We are in a time where the veils of deception are being taken down. Do you really, really think that all these generations where they used the ball earth to perpetrate a fraud on the people that, that evolution would be real or that there is no great designer or that the Big Bang Theory is real? Do you really believe? Do you not know that Satan has never told the truth? Has this escaped you somehow? Do you even realize that NASA, NASA in Hebrew means deceiver, and that NASA is such a fraud and such a scam that when you watch their videos, when you go to their channel and you look at their pictures of the earth and they tell you that they're composites and not real pictures and that all they've ever given you is cartoons and you actually believe that they were telling the truth but now that we're in a time of exposure and that Satan's veils are coming down and the truth is being exposed that you think at the exact same time that all of these people explaining that the world is flat and not a spinning wet ball and that, that the earth is not curved and you can't see a curve and water doesn't curve and water doesn't stick to a spinning ball it is absolutely impossible and that gravity is the god of science and that science has manipulated and controlled the minds and conditioned humanity that it would conform to the ways of this world and you're under this insane impression that it is in this time a time of exposure when flat earth is coming out and taking over the world 
and showing people that we have been deceived and we have been deceived greatly. You think that that's the deception. You think that, that, that during a time of exposing Satan that, that we would be being deceived. You are out of your mind. It is right now in this time of flat earth that this world is being exposed as a lie and Satan's deceptions are being exposed. Enough of your nonsense. Get right with God. Pray for discernment. During a time of great exposure is not the time that the Christians are wrong. This is the time that the Christians are correct. This is the time that the truth is coming out. If you think that Satan had dominion over this world, that he did not deceive the shape of it, that he did not deceive the design of it, so that people would believe in a, in a, in a big bang, or that people would believe in evolution, or that people would say, oh, there's no great designer. If you really think that Satan didn't deceive the world in order to have the world believe all of the other deceptions, then you are sadly mistaken. I can assure you this world has been greatly deceived and the shape of this world is a massive part of the deception because if the world found out that we were on a plane, a flat surface that has a dome over it, known as the firmament, then they would know that we are being watched, they would look at scripture differently, they would believe that there is a great designer, they would be drawn towards God, they would be removed from the ways of this world, they would stop being deceived by Satan, they would stop listening to NASA, they would stop listening to science, they would walk out of their classrooms, they would start demanding the truth, they would start demanding education to be right, they would stop listening to the liars, they would stop listening to celebrities, they would stop listening to fake news, they would start turning to God, they would turn to Jesus Christ that their spirits would be given life and that they would have an eternal life with God the Creator who put us under a firmament, who put us under a dome, that He could watch us, that He could use this plane, this existence, this design to watch us and care for us and Satan deceived us. It's flat. Get it through your heads.